Good morning and welcome to First Assembly. My name is Delena and it's so great to have you with us in this morning's worship service. If you are visiting with us today, whether in person or online, we would love to get to know you better. If you're here with us in service, we have a guest card we'd love for you to fill out at the resource table and just get to know a little bit more about you. And if you're visiting with us online, please comment, send us a message, let us know you're joining us today and we'd love to connect there. Here's a look at our weekly service schedule. Every Sunday morning, we have our morning worship service at 1030 and this service is also streamed live on our Facebook page and is available for playback on our YouTube channel. Wednesday is our midweek family night with something for everyone in the family. We have adult Bible study, Elevate Youth Service, and our kids classes and it's all starting at 7 o'clock. We'd love for you to join us for all of these great connecting points and opportunities for discipleship throughout the week. This Wednesday is Elevate Youth's annual Valentine's Day Banquet. Starts at 7 o'clock just like our weekly service and it's going to be a fun night with fun activities, a dinner, and just a great time together. So the cost for the banquet is $5 per student. If you would like your student to attend, you can let me know and I will save them a spot. That's this Wednesday, February 16th at 7 o'clock. Every fourth Saturday of the month, we participate in the 2431 Prayer Chain Network. And this is a prayer chain that is carried throughout a number of churches throughout not just the Tulsa area, but nationwide. But those churches in the Tulsa area are joining together to believe God for a mighty move in the Tulsa area. We pray for our state, we pray for our city, we pray for our country. It's a special prayer focus that we join together on every fourth Saturday. And so, this month our day for prayer is Saturday, February the 26th. If you are a part of this ministry, please remember your prayer times on the 26th and let's believe for great things. And if you're not a part of this ministry, but you would like more information, you'd like to hear more about it, or you'd like to find a prayer time, talk with Sister Dylan and she will get you connected to this great prayer ministry. For the next couple of weeks, you will likely see some Elevate students that are stationed near the resource table with chocolate. And that's because we are participating in the Oklahoma Youth Ministries candy sale. So this is a fundraiser that the Oklahoma Youth Ministries does every other year and this is the year. So these funds do go towards our campgrounds, it goes towards missions, it goes to a number of different things that the Oklahoma Youth Ministries provide for our students throughout the state of Oklahoma. So if you would like to buy candy from them, you can do that there. They are getting some perks out of it, so some of them are trying to sell as many boxes as possible with the hopes of earning a free trip to camp. Now that sounds like a good deal. Even if they don't reach that high goal, there are other opportunities for them to earn free trips and free merchandise, hoodies, shirts, so they will be pushing it hard. So if you do see them, that's what that is for. It's raising money for the Oklahoma Youth Ministries and we appreciate your support. I wanna take just a few moments to talk to you about two special things and invite you to get more information after service. The first thing I would like to talk for just a minute about is church membership. Church membership is something we might not talk about enough around here, but that's probably just because we believe everyone that's here is a part. Um, but there are ways that you can become more invested and more a part of what's happening at First Assembly, and that is through church membership. So if you would like more information about becoming a church member, Today after service, we want to invite you to meet with Don Massey in the back of the auditorium. He will be able to answer any questions you have, let you know what it's about, why it's important, why it matters, and why you should become a church member. And the second thing I'd like to talk with you about just for a minute is an opportunity that the church provides for each and every person that is connected with our church, and that is a great resource called 
Right Now Media. This is a online platform that you can access with any smart device, a phone, an iPad, a smart TV, your computer, where you can access a huge media library with anything from kid, Christian kid shows all the way up to Bible studies and different speakers and also even conferences. There are recordings of those. So there is a huge library that is all there for your encouragement, for your growth, for discipleship, and you have access to that. All of this is already available to you. If you have not already set up an account, that's your first step. So after service today, if you need help setting up an account or you would like me to send you an email that will give you the steps to set up your account, you can meet me in the back of the auditorium today after service and I'd love to walk you through that and make sure you have access to this great resource. Be sure to grab your February events calendar on the resource table on your way out of service today. And you can always stay up to date with everything that's happening here at First Assembly by finding us online at www.bixbyfirst.com. You can like and follow us on Facebook by searching Bixby First Assembly. And you can receive text messages from us by texting the number 81010 with the message at 2FDC8. You'll receive a text message that asks for your name, you text back your name, and you are fully subscribed to receive text updates from us. God is doing great things here at First Assembly, and there is a place here for you.